but it's built with uh, Old Dog Homestead. So uh, just uh, a quick video. Um, ran into an issue yesterday here at the house that I'd never run into before. Um, I got a call from Denise at work, and she had said that she had turned the stove on and that the flame on the stove was orange. Um, it's a natural gas stove, um, and so that flame should be blue. What orange indicates is the fact that there's an incomplete burn. Um, it's not burning cleanly, which could be a concern for carbon monoxide. So, um, so I started doing a little research, figure out you know what could be causing this because we haven't had a problem with the stove at all. It, um, day before it was working fine. So we uh, I did I did some uh, research and what I found was is that um, it could be you know that the gas pressure was was not where it should be, uh, lower than it should be. Um, so I started thinking, you know, is there somehow the pipe is freezing or something along that lines. Um, and then the other was, you know, it said that the, the, the it, you know, does the stove need to be cleaned? You know, so the burners, is there a lot of gunk and whatever? Well, we keep the stove very, very clean. So I knew that wasn't the issue. And then one other thing surprised me, which was a humidifier. And we had just turned a humidifier on um, the day previous because we, uh, it's been colder here in Michigan. And um, so the furnace has been running a lot. And with that, the house has been drier. So um, we decided to, you know, hook up the humidifier, get it going, just to get a little more moisture, moisture in the air. And um, so what I did last night when I got home, humidifier fire off. When we got up this morning, I turned the stove on and the flames were blue. So that pretty much told me that that was the problem. And what I believe the issue is, is as humidifier is doing what it's supposed to do, it's atomizing all those those particles and that's everything. And we have uh, hard water here. So, um, you know, all those particles, all those minerals, everything is being put into the air. Basically, the stove is burning off, which is what creates the orange flame. So um, I'll show you the orange flame as it is. I'll show you the humidifier because we did turn it back on just so I could do this video. Um, it didn't take that long for it to actually make the blue flames orange. So uh, here I'll show you that. I'll show you the humidifier um, and we'll go from there. So here are the uh, all the burners on, on, on the stove. Um, as you can see, they're burning orange shouldn't be that color. So that was uh, the big concern, obviously, like I said. And so I'm just going to shut these off and I'm going to just walk into the living room and show you the culprit. And the culprit is that deal right there. And uh, again, as soon as we had shut that off, uh, when we got up, uh, up this morning, I turned the stove on and the flames were blue again. So, um, so that is, could be the cause if you have this issue, that could in fact be the cause. So what I would suggest is that, you know, certainly check that out if you're running a humidifier. If you have this issue and you're not running a humidifier, then what I would say is to um, get your furnace checked, get your stove checked to make sure that, um, you know, you're not running into to issues, especially carbon monoxide. And we have detectors throughout the house, so, and they weren't going off, so I wasn't really concerned that that was the issue. And again, it corrected itself as soon as I, we turned that uh, humidifier off. So um, I just wanted to, thought it'd be an interesting thing to just put out there, um, you know, to make sure everyone stays safe, especially if you're in the, in the northern climate like we are, and you're running that furnace, you always want to make sure that you are in fact being safe because um, carbon monoxide is nothing to mess with and uh, um, so uh, hopefully this was helpful to you informative uh, leave a comment give us a suggestion um, whatever uh, we'll respond to those hit the like button hit the subscribe button and we'll see you on the next one take care everybody